It's like, it's like when you play the video game with no commentary. There's only, there's basically only one way to describe the game. But when there's commentary with the game, you can, uh, if you're good enough, you can make it seem like a. Uh, Every scene is kind of different. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it so well. I think it's more so with like games like uh, Battle for Bikini Bomb. Like you know that game for the PlayStation Two, Battle for Bikini Bomb, that SpongeBob mm -hmm. game. Yeah, I, I do. Or the remake of it. Um, well, uh, with Let's Players like uh, say um, Game Grumps, uh, they did they did a video of them playing at Battle for Bikini Bomb. And throughout the entire Let's Play, they're making fun of the game and seeing that this game is bad, even though it's actually a good game. And they're saying, I don't know why people like this game. And I think that's what Julian meant by Let's Plays are bad because they don't understand how good a game could be. And they're not actually playing the game, they're just making fun of the game and making fun of people who enjoy the games. So that's, I guess, that's Julian's interpretation and why he left. He's, he sounds pretty extreme. He, he sounds like he's making a lot of people... Seem as though they're a Joker Charles Manson. Exactly, I agree with yeah. with uh, Stinks. <laughs> Snicked. It's okay. Snick. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> it's it nothing like the the WWE wrestler Snitsky. I'm nothing like that. I'm Snicked. Yeah. Snicked. Gotcha. Sorry, my my mind drew a blank. It's okay. Uh, actually, actually, I'm, while we're at the topic of uh, yeah, the the SpongeBob remake game, I like the game. I I think it's a fun game. It functions. It, it's it functions. It, it functions. Yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> oh man, this game is so great. It functions. It actually, it's actually a game. So does Bob's be. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and and I shouldn't, I shouldn't have said it like that. But as a guy who didn't ever, who didn't ever touch the original game because I never actually got around to find a copy for PS2. Yeah. Um, the remake for me, well, it's a good game. It, it, I think it, it stays true. To the original formula, it looks nice. Mm -hmm. It's colorful and whatnot. I think the only addition that I don't like is the multiplayer component. Ha! That or, yeah, that that horde survivor mode. That here's I the funny thing though, like it's a great game because the original game was great, but everything new that the developers of this remake added to the game and changed about the game sucks. So actually it's because the original game is so good that this game is actually pretty good. Yeah. But the remake itself is not a very good remake. The uh, Crash uh, Insane Trilogy is a great remake. The uh, Spiral Trilogy uh, is a great remake, but this one is not a very good remake. It just It's a good game underneath it all, but the remake itself is just trash. I mean, yeah, they could have done a, a, a bit more, but there's not much you could do with Spongebob. I mean, what, what do you expect? It's a, it might be a 3D platformer that a lot of people like, but it, at the end of the day, it's a kids game. I think kids, I think kids was the main, the, the main demographic they were aiming for. However, it was, it at least it wasn't a flop. I was, yeah. I was expecting the game to be a yeah. terrible, terrible, terrible remake. Like uh, the, at the, when when it was announced, I legit just saw the screenshots of it and I was thought, this looks like shit. <laughs> Yikes! Yeah, uh, and l and luckily for me, that I was mistaken. The game turned out to be a a, a decent re remake, and for you guys like me who who can't catch the original anywhere, it suffice. But again, so that's me. the the physics of the remake actually are are decent. I mean, to me, who hasn't played the original and has nothing to compare it to. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, sorry. <laughs> I've seen gameplay footage of it. I haven't played the game, but from what I've seen, there's a bunch of physics that they messed up on. Like, you know the uh, a box of imagination that you use to teleport from location to location in the game? Well, yeah. uh, in the remake, it's not as animated. Because in the original game, when you jump into the box, it would actually fold in and then expand when you get to the next location. While in the remake, it does nothing. It's a still... It's like a uh, still image box. They just jump in and nothing happens, and you just teleport to the next location. Hmm. So it's not as well animated as the original game. I, I get, I see. Well, that sounds kind of lazy. But I know. I, but actually, it actually that 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 kind of stuff is usually uh, lazy, lazy out by the developers in remakes. If you look at Crash, at the Crash's um, remake, Insane Trilogy. Yeah, yeah. the Insane Trilogy. 
uh, on the warp room when um, on this case the second game when you see crash spawning at the level the original one had the the huge particle effects uh, when it, when he was being uh, uh, summoned in the level like he only entered the level on the remake it's just like a tiny ass vortex and crash just, just yeah. pops out like was a also another thing that I don't like is how the animation looks stiff. Oh, the, the animation is Yeah, I, I agree, because the original game was more Looney Tunes flexible in all the uh, cartoony animations yeah. and stuff, Whereas while the remake is more of an uh, on frame, on cattle thing, like an anime kind of design. It kind of look, look rigid, if I'm being honest. By the way, I need to speak a, I need to speak a little bit um, more, uh, less loud, because people here on my area starting to go to bed, and I'm being told. Yeah. Talk a little bit more, you know. So yeah, raise my volume Sorry up about on Discord. That. Yeah. No, no, it's not you. It's me. I need to talk. I know. Uh, let me guess. You, you do dishes every day too. What? What? You do you do a load of dishes every day for the family? <laughs> no, no. Basically, is um. What? Uh, my pair. My pair. My room. I have rooms. I have bedrooms next to my bedroom, and people here are, are telling that I'm speaking too loudly, so I have to speak more, uh, less loud in this case. Sorry about that. Oh, okay, no, that's okay. I, I just thought that you did a lot of dishes for your family today. If you don't, that's yeah. that's really cool. That's, yeah. No, I, I do. I know I do, but uh, it's not a lot of dishes. We're not a lot here. We are not a lot of people here in my household. But, yeah. I, I'm don't sorry, don't put up with that. No, uh mm -mm. I'm, I'm sorry, It's funny how guys. everyone in this Discord uh, call is stuck at uh, home because of uh, COVID. So everyone's living with their parents right now. Except for yeah. me. Yeah, I'm, I'm living with my parents because, again, I have no... I have no proper, I have no proper no job. I was, I was yeah. aiming to to know actually start working on it, but so by the end of 2020 I could have got my own place. But I only got a job around the end of 20 of 2020. Funny. It's a similar, it's a similar issue with me because I got a few uh, freelance jobs going on right now. Like the very far oh, yeah. few in between, they're not paying as well as they used to. Because back oh. in the day, I can do do like multiple freelance jobs and get paid pretty well. But because of COVID, there's far and few in, in between freelance jobs you can do. So I'm stuck at home for now because I, of it. I, my, my job is a part time. It was the only thing I could uh, I could get. So I yeah. Mean, I mean, I don't have to pay for anything yet, but I would like to do a, a full-time job in the future. In the future. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I saw, I saw that 2021 is better. People, people in, the, in, the, in the future, like 50 years from now, in the history books, will write COVID as the, as the pandemic that made everyone stay in home making memes. <laughs> yep. <laughs> nice. The, literally, the, the only people that, that, that really enjoyed the pandemic were the kids. Kids pretty much just got an extended vacation. There's exactly. A, there's a small percentage of us that actually... It, it it might sound harsh, but there's a very small percentage of us that actually grew out of this, and I'm I'm somehow one of them. It, it makes no sense. It's just, it's just life. I, I don't understand how, how it happened, but it happened. COVID changed snits. Completely. Yeah, yeah, it, now he's a completely different person. It kind of did. Yeah. Instead of look at my snit, he's now look at my crotch. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, he's over there like hard. He's over there hard. You see my face? You don't. Look at my balls instead. That's, that's how, right. <laughs> that's what life. That's how 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 hard in my life my life made me. But yeah, actually, in, it to me COVID has become like daily, like a mundane daily life for me. It's almost like yeah. life has been the same with COVID. I can't picture life without the masks. I can't picture life without the restrictions now. It has become very, very depressing. I miss 2019. We still had our freedom back then. Freedom. It, it almost looks like, like we're stuck or some shit. Mm -hmm. I beat yep. so many games in uh, 2020 because of COVID. Now I know how it's I feel. It's a giant right. catalog yeah. of Xbox One games and PS3 games I just completed. I just played a lot of Gary's mod, CM Thieves. Nice. I played. I finally played The Forest. That um, I don't know if you. I don't know if you know the game I'm talking about. I was about to. Oh, you were about to? Yeah, I have it on my PC right now. Yeah. Oh, nice. I enjoy it. It's, it's one hell of a game. I enjoyed it. 
I played with my friend, we did co-op, we beat it. It was fun, I enjoyed it. Back then I still had my, my, my shitty PC desktop, so I played on the lowest settings at 15 FPS. Okay. And the, the fucking thing, like, literally was hot as all hell. I'm not oh sure yeah, the, laptops for you. No, not laptops, it was literally a desktop. It was oh, the, wow. It was a shitty Optiplex uh, a Dell laptop. Not sure if you know what I'm talking about, but it's it's a it's a, an office desktop. It had the, the it had a good processor, it had good RAM, it just didn't have a graphics card, so it ran like shit the games. And um, yeah, I played that. CFT has been the game I've been playing the most with my friends. That and Rust, but uh, I've been mostly playing a lot of multiplayer games. And I've been uh, being being stuck at home made me kind of depressed. I mostly spent a lot of my months looking at the ceiling, lis listening to Lo-Fi. <laughs> Joji, and, and you listen to Joji? I listen to I also yes I listen to Joji. I, nice. I, but um, I I didn't like the newest album that he made. I uh, next I don't year. Okay. But yeah, I didn't like it a lot. I, I mean, I didn't like I didn't like it. In, uh, I didn't like it at yeah. all. It, I, I thought it was I thought it was very generic to be honest. Generic. Yeah, he should move back to Filthy Frank. You're right. Yeah. I mean, not Filthy Frank. His no, music okay. also, his, his music was also very. Eh, it was very satirical. It okay. had its fun. It had its place in history, but now it's just eh, to me yeah. at least. Yeah, I guess that's that's all I have to say. Hmm. How are how are you? How did you went by this past few months? I've always wanted to jump on Who, who are you talking to? Both of you. <laughs> oh my god. Well, I mean, you can explain, Snit, if you want. You can go for us. Yeah, sure. I, I... I recently just moved into a new apartment about a week ago. I'm getting everything in, in, into it. But, but before then, I was... I was mainly just sleeping on on a couch and i've i don't have i have some bad allergies i live with, with my mom my brother and my sister and and a couple of cats and every once in a while one of the cats would, would take a piss near the couch and that would just ruin my my, my whole day 